everybody and welcome back to the Joel Domain YouTube channel and to yet another Oxford United match day vlog. Today, Oxford United are back home at the Kassam Stadium under the lights on a Tuesday night as we face Derby County, who were also promoted from League One last season as they finished second in the league. Last time Oxford faced Derby, Oxford went 2-0 up, one from the spot and the second an absolutely unbelievable free kick from Cameron Brannigan and Oxford United left the Kassam with a 3-2 loss. But that is ancient history now as both these sides are in a completely new league, a completely a new challenge higher up in the football pyramid and battling for points to secure themselves as a championship outfit. Oxford United and Derby County both have the same amount of points and they sit next to each other in the league in 11th for Oxford and 12th for Derby. So this is a really, really important game. But not really because we're so early into the season, but for the sake of excitement, this is a really, really important game. But before anything, I think it's time to get it out of the way. Here's my predicted lineup for today's game. So then, here's my predicted lineup to face Derby County. In goal, as usual, number one, Jamie Cumming. And the defence will be as followed. Kieran Brown, Ben Nelson, Elliot Moore and Peter Kyoto. In the midfield, I've gone for Louis Sibley, Will Volks and Idris El Mazzouni. On the left wing, I've gone for Suriki Dembele. On the right wing, I've gone for Tyler Goodrum. And up front, I've gone for Dane Scarlett, who obviously came off the bench to score last game. And this is nothing against Mark Harris. I think he's a fabulous striker, but he's played every single game. I think we should probably give him rest and give Dane Scarlett a go. So that's my predicted lineup for today's game. Now we must stop waffling. It's time for these two sides who both shared promotion glory last season to face off at the Kassam Stadium. Let's see who comes out on top in this exciting clash. Let's head to a three standard fortress. Morning, morning, once again. Getting ready to get on the bus to head down to the Kassam Stadium. About to meet the guests, asking the predictions, all of that stuff. So let's get that straight under the way now. He's made it. One day you won't. I've said it before. Zach, welcome back to the channel. But before we go anywhere, what's your prediction of today's game? 3-1. To Oxford? Yeah. We always got to check. We always got to check. Yeah, I think 2-1. And I think Louis Sibley's going to score against his former team. I think it's written in the stars. Louis Sibley against Derby, against his former team. He's just left him, obviously. He must start tonight, in my opinion. Um, you know, Ruben Rodriguez, is a fantastic player, but he, he started every game, man. I mean, you've got to give the player a rest. Same with Mark Harris. I wouldn't be that angry if I saw Mark Harris starting. Fantastic striker. But I do feel like we need to, to rest him and start Dane Scarlett. Would, would you agree with that? Yeah, alright. Well, yeah, 2 1 for me, 3 1 for you. Let's get on the bus. So now we've got the lineups. Uh, I'm going to read them here. So, Jamie Cumming, Kieran Brown, Will Volks, Elliot Moore, Idris El Mazzouni, Ben Nelson, Tyler Goodrum, Ruben Rodriguez, Sir Ricky Dembele, Peter Chioso, and Dane Scarlett. On the bench, Shingram, Lalo, Keckron, Harris, there we are, Sibley, Dale, Lee, and Ter Abbott. So, yeah. That is what was uh, predicted, but Rodriguez starts, which I didn't expect, but Harris has been dropped for Scarlet, so there we go. So then we arrived at the fortress, haven't we, Zach? Yeah. Getting ready for today's game then? Of course. So you've seen the lineup now, you're still going with that same 3 1 prediction, yeah? Yeah, coming bicycle kick, mate. <laughs> coming bicycle kick. Imagine if it happened one day, though. That would actually be mental. Because there was a goalkeeper that, like, in I don't know what competition was, like Afcon or something, yeah. who scored that, that, like, was it a scorpion kick or something? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, anyway, um, we've got like 65% battery, so a little bit conscious of how much filming to do tonight. Um, because the problem with these evening kickoffs is you have like a whole day before, and then you drain your phone battery out. It was much better when I used to use a camera. Why Why do I waffle so much, man? I don't even know. They would work out this, these stairs, aren't they? Yeah, bloody hell, do you? Up the stairs we go. Up the bloody stairs we go. Warm-ups complete then, the boys are heading back in now for their final preparations. We are just 
about 10, 15 minutes away from kickoff. Hopefully today can be another smashing performance. In the last video, you did that statement to Toby that age all right. Make a statement now about this game and we'll see how it ages. 9-0 win. Yeah. And how confident are you? Very, yeah. This is two. How old are you, mate? Kick off soon. Another day without you being the mascot of human. Sort that out, please, yeah? Cheers, appreciate it. Derby wearing white, off to their traditional yellow, of course. There we go, then, kick off about to be underway. Kick off, come on, then, come on. Oh, Early chance. Look at the belly over the bar. Derby are in our box here. Really good defender by the ball the boys. Come on, Dane. What is that? Oh yeah, yeah cool. May is throwing, I think maybe. Will Volk's throw, we know what happened last time. Never mind, Kira Brown's gonna take it. Oh lovely that. Unlucky. Slipping these balls through, you just can't get onto them. Oh, it's like a good remorse back to look in the box. <laughs> How is that not a foul? How is that not a foul? Wait, this is amazing, this attack is amazing. Oh my god! We just sat down their whole defence. Oh, that's sloppy though, that's sloppy. Oh, I thought he slipped, but it's a foul. Okay, this is nice. It's, um, it's nice. Oh, it's, it's, it's slow, isn't it? Go on. Go on. A clinical finish from Jane Scarlett. Oh, very good finish. 1 0. Come on! Nice guys are great! You'll never notice how much I love you till you take my Oxford away. Oh, he was an excellent shot. Sat down our defence, but it's deflected. Oh dear. Oh, corner, corner to Derby. Corner to Derby. Corner to Derby. Oh, oh. Good defending first time. We like that, we like that. Yeah, so we're giving away position again. Crossing to the box. Nobody there, Kieran Brown there. Another one of these free kicks is Ali. There's a couple of these. Um, they're going to try whipping in the box. Uh oh, good catch by Jamie Cullen. Go. Goal kick straight to the middle. Here Back to Pete Goto. Yeah, it's nice play, it's nice play. Trying to find Dembele, but stick to what you're good at. He just hasn't. He just hasn't. Oh my God! Derby just wide in the post. And guess what happened? We gave away possession. It's a bit of a recurring theme this this half. Oh! How close do you get? Absolutely terrific run. Tries to flash it across, nothing comes of it. It goes wide. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Silent Gunjim again. We know what he does in this position. My god, be over excited. The play between Idris and Mosuni and Sibiki Dembele is lovely, and here is Dembele. Oh my god! Warner! Oh. Tim comes out to a long shot, Tyler Gruzan, but he's hit the defender. 
Um, since the goal, it's been a pretty sort of half, 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 that makes sense. Um, chance of both sides. Um, so it's way down the clock now. 43 minutes on the clock. And now here come Derby. Into the box. Really good defending by PK. Puts it out for a corner. Great hands and things like that. Ruben Rodriguez gifted a ball in the box straight through. It's been deflected, but a Cleveland handball, no penalty given. Two minutes of out of time, first half. Penalties, 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 penalties. He has got away from there. He's not gone to ground to a pen, but he was tugging him down. Jesus. That's the half time whistle. Oxford lead by one goal for them. So then, if you can hear us over the announcement, it's half time, and as always, it's over to the guest. Zach, what are your half time thoughts? Great, right. yeah, it's really good. Um, goal, yeah. Simply put, simply put. Here's the thing, here's what it is for me. We've been good, our attacking plays been fabulous. Obviously, great play to make the goal. The amount of times we gave up possession then, that was quite scary to watch. You know, he waits a bit high, I was worried about the arm. It's a joke. Is it? I don't know. It was a stressful half. We're playing alright. I'm not like, you know, massively concerned. But the possession given away was a bit was a bit nervy, if that makes sense. So yeah, nervy half. We're doing well. One more goal or two would really help settle the nerves. Let's see how the second half goes. That's in the hole. Pretty good. That's what you said something. I didn't. I asked you a question. It was a full-on answer. No, I asked you a question. What? Did you, you, I know you say you can't hear me, but I asked you a question. What was it? What's your thoughts on the uh, second half? What's your predictions? That's a load of bollocks, that one. What's your prediction on the second half? Yeah, 4-2. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah. Right. Uh, no, uh, two. You're such a rubbish What are you talking about? So maybe Dembele's come off well in there. I didn't expect that, but I don't hate it. Second half. Here we go. Bloody hell. Team is doing jobs. There we go. Second half on the way. Come on! Oh my dear God. Let's see. Bloody hell. His reaction, I imagine something happened. I didn't see it. I've got my scarf on second half, but I found it in my bag. El Mizuba. Here we go. Derby in the box and <laughs> deflected over. Again, very much disrespected by my co host there. Yeah, off camera though, so it's not funny. Sort it out. That's a save. Again, really, really, really worried with the amount of time Yeah. It's a bit scary, isn't it? We're losing, more, losing possession more than. Um, Pro clubs. I don't want to say their name. What was that? What even just happened? I wasn't even blooming. Mate, the double chin came out then. I just saw the replay. What is going on? How have, how have we conceded that? Who watched the replay? On the screen. I know you were saying that. We were, they were going to eat fries like West Brom, but it's a bit early in the game. It's not now. This is not game over yet. We're going to come back. Jeez, always negativity. Yeah, right, can we see the replay of the goal? I want to see what happens. I mean, from, from what I saw, it looked like we just sort of gave away possession again. And a little bit of a woo -hoo, and then it sort of went straight down the middle. Well, I can't describe it better than that because I didn't really see it. Wake up, Oxford! I don't even know what's going on there, but... It's just, it's just the defending today hasn't been anything near what it has been for the previous home games. It's just sloppy. Free kick to Oxford on the edge of the box. There's where the free kick is for reference. Dane Scarlett's take actually, which should be interesting. Don't know how Dane Scarlett takes free kicks. He has taken it into the keeper's hands. Dane Scarlett is coming on. Mark Harris is coming on. What a shift from Dane. What a shift. Will Volk's coming off for Josh McEachran. <laughs> and Idris El Mazzuni comes off for Louis Sibley. He's played for Derby, of course. Of course, it's Josh McEachran's first game in a few weeks as he uh, was injured. He's back, it's good to see him back. He's 
Tessa lost again. And yeah, it's last across, I think. So but yeah, it's a corner, cool, it's a corner cool start. Zach's left me. Temporarily. Hopefully we don't score what he's done. Well, I hope we do actually because I want to score. Get her out of there, you can miss it. Don't matter. Don't even like him anyway. I'm joking. Oh, <laughs> sorry, over the bar. Yeah, I'm joking. I do like him. Promise. Here comes. Here comes Zach. He's made it back. Ruben Rodriguez scored a bicycle kick, but it was offside. What? Yeah, no. Bicycle kick from Ruben Rodriguez, but oh, yeah, it was offside. Yeah. No, he did. I promise. Why am I lying about something like that, man? Kieran Brown come. with a throw in. And it's a foul, goal kick to Derby. Hey! Three kicks to Watkins, Louis Sibley's taken out. Um, Zach, do my job, describe where the free kick is, because I can't show it. Uh, left, right and centre. It's not them, is it? Where actually is it? Just like in front of the centre circle, yes. Yep. On, on, towards our goal, obviously. I kept going to take it. Oh, oh, carried out by better kick. Oh, 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 Pet check, whatever it is. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Um, as my assistant, can you just conduct some research, please? Yeah. Oh, I just conduct some research. Headgear. I think it's just called headgear. Also, there's a fire. Of <laughs> course. Sure. Well, there's a fire engine, but it's silent. I hope there's not a fire. That's very bad, obviously. But there is a fire engine. Just sitting in the car park, it's fire, but there's lights. I promise it will be good for now. Corner to Derby. You, you almost jinx it. Yeah. Greg Lee's warming up, getting ready to come on. I love Greg Lee so much. There wasn't a better man to get as a winner. Come on, Greg. Come on, Dale. Come on, Dale. Tyler Goodrum. Oh. Ruben Rodriguez. Simply. Oh. Dale. Rodriguez coming off for Greg Lee, so I imagine Tyler Goodrum will now go to the camp and Greg Lee will play on the wing for the last 45 minutes. Ole, ole, ole! Greg Lee! Greg Lee! Mark Harris. Here we go, here we go, come on, please! Greg Lee picks up the pieces. Oh! We're into the 89th minute here and it's still 1-1. Clock's running down so quickly. Again, it's another point. Still unbeaten at home, but it would be a shame not to win this game, really would. Six added minutes to get a winner. Maybe. Simple. Nope, back again. Oh, great lead. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Tyler Goodrum! Oh! Wow. Tenders 11,443. Man of the match, Elite Mall. Uh oh, free kick. Sent to Zerpolish to Derby at the end of the game. <gasps> yes, come in! Good, oh. good. Two minutes. Oh, Greg Lee! Yeah. 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 Apparently, Kieran Brown. Oh! Kieran Brown throw in. Take it. Oh. Last few seconds. What? Let me full time. Yeah, full time 1 1 fair play. That's the point. No denying that's the point, but we're still unbeaten at home. Thank you again, Mr. Blue Knight, 1423. Elliot Moore.
I mean, look, if we're being honest, if you look at where the, 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 both the teams are in the league, where both the teams are uh, in terms of how they've done this season, uh, a point does make sense, doesn't it? Really? Um, but I just feel like the goal we conceded was so sloppy, for lack of better words. Um, we could have defended it better. Um, that's what I'm disappointed about. Same for you? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Good. Back home, it's actually the day after. These vlogs take quite a long time to make, to be honest, and especially when it's a late kickoff, it, it's now 1.41 the next day, so I do apologise about that. But let's get some full-time thoughts. So I think first half, we were the better team by far. I think that the Derby fans would probably agree with that. In fact, Paul Warren, the Derby manager, does agree with that. Um, but then I think second half, Derby came straight at us. It was a more even half until we sort of fell apart in periods, gave away possessions so many times that game. Um, you know, I was watching the lot vlog back, and obviously I don't film for the whole 90 minutes, um, so there were times when we lost possession off camera as well, and it's just, it felt like a bit of a recurring theme, but that does happen in some football matches, like I'm not too bothered. The result is another point in the championship, it does mean that we're still unbeaten at home, we're still in a good position in the championship, but... That is our fifth draw in a row, which is a little bit disappointing, but we knew this league was going to be tough, so we keep going. Next game, Sunderland away. I'm not going to be there. I'm on holiday in Greece, in Corfu. I don't think I'd be going Sunderland away anyway, to be honest, but I won't be there at all. Um, so yeah, and then I'll be back with you for Swansea because I land back into England the day before. So I'll see you at the Kassam at home on Swansea. Final message, thank you for watching today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed. I really do appreciate it. And also, I want to give my best wishes to Des Buckingham who uh, left the stadium unwell in yesterday's game so I hope that he is doing all okay um, so yeah thanks for watching and take care